Today we are honoring the men and women who are or have served our country. But did you know this entire week is also dedicated to military families starting their own businesses? That's right. It is also National Veterans Small Business Week. And you may not know there are specific resources available to help vets start and operate their own businesses. NBC5's Anna Cooper spoke with one veteran turned small business owner in our region. She joins us live in Starksboro right now. Anna, what's his advice for aspiring entrepreneurs? Yeah, well, Lauren and Adrian, after years serving in the U.S. Marines, Kevin Moyer came to Vermont to become a small business owner. And now after a couple of years in this business at Vermont Frames here in Starksboro, he says the one key to starting a small business is having some patience. It's an adventure, that's for sure. This year marks a decade since Kevin Moyer was discharged from the Marines. Because of 9-11, I was in high school and that day really uh, changed my life as it did for many people and I wanted to serve. After college, Kevin served for six years in Afghanistan and Japan before going on to business school and working in consulting. I know that I couldn't do what I'm doing right now if it hadn't been for what I learned in the military and what I learned in those jobs. Today, he's the owner of Vermont Frames. He and his team design, build, and assemble the structures of homes and more all across the country. These humans here and, and the pride they take in this and how much they care, uh, I didn't think I'd find that again after I got out of the Marine Corps. It makes me really proud to be part of this team. He says every day he sees his service play a critical role in his success as a small business owner. The leadership, the flexibility, understanding how complex systems and, and large groups of humans work together. That's why he's encouraging any veterans who are also looking to become small business owners. And Holly Aker with the Vermont Small Business Association can help you get started. It's really important for veteran entrepreneurs to build a team around them, uh, support for their small business. Aker says one way to build your team is coming out to events organized by the Vermont SBA. It's an opportunity for veterans or their spouses to learn the basics of starting a business. Join us for this day of uh, understanding the key principles of entrepreneurship led by the resources that are available in the community for you and also veteran entrepreneurs who have already been in your shoes. And as someone who has been, Kevin says he's here to lend support along the way. But I'm certainly going to be rooting for you and I'm always here to help. And Anna, you mentioned events the Vermont Small Business Association is hosting for veterans this week. Can you tell us more about those resources? Yeah, certainly. So tomorrow, the Small Business Administration is hosting the Boots to Business Reboot. It's an opportunity for veterans who have already started small businesses all across the state to come together and basically break down the basics for veteran families here in Vermont about ways and opportunities that they can start their own small businesses if they're interested in doing so. It's an important opportunity for you as a veteran to use these resources and build a great team around you so that you can find success as a small business owner. And some of the things that this event will offer is how to access capital, technical assistance and contracting opportunities. The event is free, but you will need to sign up before attending. And if you can't make it tomorrow, the SBA is offering other opportunities to help out veterans who are looking to become small business owners. We're live in Starksboro, Anna Goober, NBC5 News.